When you first switch Windows 7 on, you'll have a desktop background. So the image I've got here is just one of architecture. Now, obviously, looking at the same picture day on day in can be quite boring. So you do have a number of different images supplied with your machine. And the quickest way to get to these, if you right click on any empty area of your desktop, and then the list will come up and if you go all the way down to the bottom and choose the option for personalize this will bring up the uh, personalization window and this gives you the option of choosing the different themes that Microsoft have already installed for you and the best way to get down to these is in the bottom left hand corner here if you just click on desktop background that will actually bring up a window and then through this list you can see all the images that you have available now you'll see in the top right this is the one I currently have selected and there's a tick box in there now you can just go through and just click on either one in turn and find the one that you like and obviously again that's going to give you that one image and that image will stay until you change it now there are another feature that Microsoft have allowed you to do and if you hold the control key down and then click on another picture you'll see there's two tick boxes so I now have two pictures selected so I can scroll through the list um, just choose another one hold the control key down press the left mouse button again and I now have three pictures selected now down here um, you can see that it's going to change the picture every 10 seconds and this is kind of creating a slideshow um, and with the drop down menu you can change that so you can just say right okay just change the picture on a daily basis right the way through by hour minute all the way down to 10 seconds and if you are running it on laptop um, on battery power there is an option to disable this wind this slideshow feature just to save on a bit of battery power um, and that's it that's the um, quickest way to change your desktop background and just choose your save changes